What's going on, everybody? This is D-Brother72. Can't stop God coming to me with another video. People love their sin more than they do God. And God is giving it to them, all right? Understand? You know, and God is saying, well, you want your, your fornication, your idolatry, your, you know, adultery, you know, your lesbianism, your homosexuality, your transgenderism, LGBT, your cussing, you know, your uh, Ouija boards, your all the that wickedness is sin. Guys, is to say, go ahead, you can have it. But God says, you're not coming into my heaven. <laughs> yeah. A lot of shot people is going to hear those terrifying words. I don't know you. I never knew you. Depart from me, you workers of lawlessness. Matthew 7, 21 through 23. You know, that's the reason why me daily, I repent daily. I ask the Lord to forgive me for all my sins, man. Because I'm trying to strive for righteousness, understand? And finally, this woman done got it, understand? You know, she says that any time that you think that you can go live whatever you want just because you saved, sealed, sanctified, then you're not saved. You know, it seems like that she's coming around. She sees that she's that uh, she sees that she's coming around because I've been saying this all my life on YouTube and on Instagram and on Rumble. So, not to be perfect. You know, it's not about my righteousness that that get to heaven. It's Jesus Christ through me we get to heaven. Now, when the Bible says that people want their sin, Romans 1 talks about, you know, you got people you got types of people that's given that God is giving over to a reprobate mind. You know who they are? If you used to read Romans 1, it talks about the humanism. Humanism, you know, believe that you are they they are in their own guys and they believe in in science and whatnot. Evolution <clears throat> believe that you are raw revolve around apes and and fishes and all <clears throat> and all of that stuff, right? The biggest one. It's atheism. They believe that there is no God. Understand? <laughs> and then you got the earth worshippers. They worship in Mother Earth. Understand? And all through Romans one, all the way, all, all the way, like from one all the way to thirty-two, earth worshippers. Understand? They be worshiping Mother Earth. Understand? You know, they be worshiping, you know, sea creatures. Dogs, cats, you know, all types of stuff, right? You know, and the Bible talks about bestiality, how bestiality is a, is a wicked sin, right? You know, Leviticus 18, 23, understand, right? And, and it talks about sodomites, transgenders, LGBT, and all of that, you know. And if you used to go to Genesis 13, 13, the land of Sodom, our wicked and sinners before the Lord is sinning. So which means that you got uh, this, you know, they are sinners before the Lord more exceedingly right now than Sodom and Gomorrah. Understand? So it's like this, man. These people want their sin more than God. See, they can have it. See, God had enough with these, these rebellious, wicked folks, understand? And now they're going to say God loves them for who they are and all of that. That's a lie. See, God is trying, giving them time and time and time to repent of their sins and turn from their sins, right? And see, you know, uh, they love going to, going to clubs. They're going to bars and, and drink and do all type of stuff. Uh, gamble, that's covetousness, understand? That should not cover, understand? And see, I'm gonna tell you something though, man. Um, I was once like that, understand? And I've had fallen short 
and I ask the Lord to forgive me for that, understand? Because I don't like being in here. I don't like being in these places, man. For real. Sometimes, you know, uh, I guess like, uh, <clears throat> um, after, you know, you got to go to a, used to restroom room, restroom or something like that, man. But I don't like going in these places, man, because I don't belong there, man. I'm supposed to be separate from the world. Not, not I am in the world, but not of the world, understand? So, thank God that I do have convictions on the Holy Spirit, understand, to, to, to try me and, and, and to uh, tell me, nah, you, you know, uh, don't do this again, you know what I'm saying? Try not to do it, don't do this again. Try not to do it again because I'm, I'm, I'm struggling, I'm struggling again. And uh, between old man and new man, right? But as long as I know, I'm trying to live a holy life. That's exactly what I'm gonna do, right? As far as um, you know, people um, it's like you got people uh, rejected God. They want a God that accepted him in their sin, right? That's why Jesus says that there's false prophets and false teachers arising to deceive many. Understand? So, which means um, Matthew 24, 11, right? And Cross reference with um, some shit departs from the faith, giving heed to seducing spirits and doctrines of devils, right? Speak of lies and hypocrisy, having the conscience with a high iron. First Timothy chapter 4, 1 and 2, right? And um, 2 Timothy chapter 3 talks about the qualities of sinners, understand that's uh, doing wicked things, abandoning it against God, you know? And, and now we live in perilous times. Um, Perilous times shall come, you know, you know, also the last days perilous times shall come. There will be lovers of themselves, covetous, vultures, proud, blasphemers, disobedience to parents, unthankful, unholy, without natural affection, truth breakers, false accusers, and kindly fierce, those to despise us, those that are good, trady, heady, high-minded, lovers of pleasure, more than lovers of God, having a form of godliness to deny the the party of but search turn away for this sort they did creep into houses and they kept the silly women laid with sins laid away with the first lust ever learning never will come to the knowledge of the truth so um with that situation man <clears throat> everything that the bible has been talking about you know disobedient to parents understand is being fulfilled lovers of themselves that's talking about lovers of their ethnicity Understand they lovers of, you know, they taking the pictures of one another and this and that and looking in the mirror and looking me, 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 I, 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 and all that type of stuff. You know, none of them was all to that. You know, blacks doing that, whites doing that, Puerto Ricans doing that, Asians doing that, you know, Filipinos doing that, you know, looking at themselves and said, yeah, I'm this, I'm the best, and I'm this, and I'm the prettiest, and I'm the handsomest, I'm this, and I'm that, and all that. I, I, I look at them and that, no, you're not. You're not all of that, understand? And see, I'm gonna tell you something, man. <clears throat> I'm, I'm a handsome man, you know, I'm 6'5". But I'm going right here just bragging on myself because if I brag on myself, that means that I, I, I'm not bragging on Jesus Christ. But I'm bragging on Jesus Christ because I got his righteousness, not my own. So, therefore, uh, the people who, uh, you know, have been told and have been showed, now they have no clue for their sin. Now, if they haven't been told and showed, they have an excuse. But now, Romans 1, 20 says that they are now without excuse. Because he's talking about the creation and, 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 the, and the things like the birds and, and, and the trees and everything in the sky that God had met and had showed it to them like forces, uh, forces, uh, internal power and all that, right? So, um, and see, it's like, um, they believe, they think that they know God, but they glorify not him, not as God. And they were, they, they were not thankful, understand? Cross reference with, uh, what it says, unthankful, uh, right? They don't thank God once they wake up in the morning. Understand? They don't thank, they don't praise God when they wake up. See, they don't pray when they uh, before they eat. Understand? That's the problem. Understand? See, that's what. We, see, our praise 
when I wake up. Me and my wife wake up, but understand, we pray, you know, and uh, and, we, and before we eat, we pray, understand, that's what, that's how I keep a relationship with the Lord, that's how we keep a relationship with the Lord, because I'm, because I want, I want God, see, I want more God than my sin, I hate my sin, I hate my sin in my life, see, I love God, and I hate my sin, see, people that don't want God in their life, they love sin, they love sin, they love to lay down uh, in the mud like a pig, pigs love sin that's right pigs love sin lambs love do not love the mud you know they they get out of the mud understand see they get in there they, they uh, fall in there and they get right back up understand it may take them a little while but they get back up because they hate it they hate the mud see it's like it takes a while so the, the, the sin that you fall into, understand? Eventually, you're going to get tired of it. You're going to get out of that, understand? Because you know why? That means you got the Holy Spirit in you, convicted you, and said, nah, nah, you know what I'm saying? See, praise God that I had the Holy Spirit in me. So that's why I need God and I love God more. And those people that don't love God and hate and and and, and, and hate God, they love their sin. And, oh, so God is, go, God is giving up to a rubber baby mind and the bodies between themselves, the lustful hearts and everything, right? And see, their body is gone, the mind goes, you know, the body goes, the mind goes, you know, and the heart is right, and you know, for real, because it's talking about wickedness, that's the end. Jeremiah 17 verse 9 says that the heart is deceitful above all things and that's beautifully wicked. Who can do them? Understand? See, a humble man or woman admit that they are wicked and need a savior. Understand? A proud person, a haughty, lofty person don't believe that they have a wicked heart. Understand? But guess what they do? Understand? See, and see that's the reason why you try to tell them. Understand? The, the Bible says shut the dust off your feet and keep it moving. But you go always go have those that want to repent and get a left over to Jesus Christ and and uh, take God's side against themselves. See, those that love sin, they take sin over God. That's backwards, understand? I take God's side against myself every day, understand? You see? And um, another thing, you know, sinners, you know, they worship themselves for us, ethnicity like this. You know, like black Hebrew Israelites, KKKs, you know, 5% nations and, and Rastafarians and all that stuff. That's a religion, I understand? So which means that they thinking that they can go to heaven of their own righteousness. See, that's a problem. If you take your own righteousness, take off, take off your own righteousness and put on Jesus' righteousness, then you're going to go to heaven. See, I got on Jesus' righteousness, not my own, I understand? So... Those that hate God will put a will will um what they want on way to heaven by putting on their fifty rags of righteousness. Like uh, Isaiah fifty uh, sixty four six says that you are righteousness are as fifty rags. So right, so therefore man. Uh, the God give them over to a reverend mind. He gives them over to a reverend mind. A lot of them, but they are not going to God's heaven. So, again, once they stand before a holy God, once they die and end up in hell fire, I understand. And, uh, you know, and until the a thousand year reign of Christ is up, they're going to meet Jesus at the great right throne judgment. And um, God's going to judge them for their sins and what they did, I understand. And why they haven't repented it to get their life over to Jesus Christ. You know, they should have been smart by God has given them time and time and time again to repent and get their life over to him just so, just so they won't go in the great tribulation or they won't go in the great uh, great right throne judgment. So I praise God that I chose heaven. I chose God. And I choose, you know, to go to heaven and hate my sin. I hate it. I hate it in my life. So... And uh, God is um, blessing me, rewarding me, and, 
and, and my wife, understand? So, I'm going to continue to do what I got to do, understand? So, people love their sin more than God. <laughs> On the flip side, me and those that love, love Jesus appearing love God more than our sin. We hate our sin. So, 